So you're looking for more of a tuned exhaust just for that vehicle? Is that what you're looking at for better performance? Yes, and no, it's not too so much for performance you can get out of it if you're not, you know, doing a long suit. Yeah, okay. You know I mean? As far as my header side, so I'm just looking for a little bit more of an aggressive sound to it. Okay. Yeah, just a little more. <laughs> All right. Yeah, it sounds, it sounds He wants better. to wake his neighbors up every morning at 4 o'clock on his way to work. I'm on my way to work, absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> if I can't see you ain't sleeping either, neighbor. <laughs> Public archives. Since I put that supercharger on, it okay. sounds even better. Than this. Yeah. Sure. Now, am I correct in saying if you guys take your car, put a supercharger or something on that, are you already well anointing your uh, warranty on that vehicle by modifying that engine? Only if they know about it, yeah. Well, when you blow it up, right. aren't they going to know something's <laughs> up? <laughs> I put a, uh, a new design from Hello Brock, a street um, low profile. Yeah, low profile, and um, I also got, you know, the, the program from them, so to tune it, yeah, yeah, I mean, it came up, came with an upgraded system, uh, fuel, fuel injection system. Uh, bigger injections. Yeah, 50 gallon an hour. Like the oil pump. Yeah, different lines for cooling and stuff for that supercharger? No, uh, actually, I got a new intercooler. And uh, um, you know the, the radiator put in front of the yeah. yeah. uh, supercharger. Yeah. That's cool. And I uh, and it came and the kit came with the uh, electric water pump, so I'm not attached to that. Yeah, I had to uh, key the cooling for the um, for the supercharger so it didn't spin. Mm -hmm. um, All right. There was a I did a lot of that. Thing. And now it's it's a beast on these. They're probably beast before. Yeah. What are they running? Probably hard to keep traction now. Well, I got nittles on it, and once those tires heat up, it's all over. Uh, so they're like a 50-50 thread right now. Yeah. Well, that's got that traction control system on it, too, though, right? But I have a... Turn it on, turn it off. Right. Uh, it doesn't shut it all the way off. I have a program. Okay. I got a team right now. You got to go. You got to get past. Take care. Nice being here. Hopefully we'll see you again. Yeah. Good. I didn't scare you away. Darn. You know? <laughs> so hopefully we're rooting on another uh, another uh, round of playoffs for the Blue Jazz. That's a 14 RT. Okay, so you got a 572. See, I got the same motor, but I put that supercharger in. It also fits. Well, obviously, it fits. Yeah, man, I that thing is so much more fun to drive. Yeah. It's it's uh. Oh, let me show you. This, this <laughs> is uh. Yeah, I wish I know how I got stopped by a cop for those. Mm. Yeah, because they're green. You can't, you're not supposed to have anything like that. For what? You're on your headlights. Oh, yeah? They don't let you put green halos? No. They don't want none of that. Who cares? I mean, I can see some things that you got to care about. Like the guys who tint out their brake lights. Right. Mm -hmm. I'm not a fan. Yeah. But a green halo, I mean, who cares? Yeah, I, um, so what I did was I got the new Bluetooth one where I can change the color. You gotta open up the headlights for that. Right? Yeah, yeah, pull the whole front clip off. Mm -hmm. This will be like the third time I've pulled it. It's not hard, man. It's just a couple bolts, dude. A couple bolts and a bunch of plastic snap on. Crap. 